<laughs> yeah, that's me. Can't be Laz. He's been gone for ages doing his teaching job that he's enjoying so much. Yeah. Nothing like not skipping the cutscene and hitting pause instead. New strat, pause buffer. Yep. And sick and sleepy the whole week, I know how that feels. Please don't jump, that's all I want, just don't jump. Okay. While you still jump, you can Ah, it's still a terrible oh, intro time, but whatever. Don't care, don't care. <sighs> don't start that cutscene. I didn't tell you to start no cutscene. So how you been lately, Joma? Been good. Busy, but good. Basically the same. Yep. Gonna get even busier soon. Uh, when I moved here, uh, my... I don't want to call her my supervisor, because she's really not, but... <laughs> she's higher than my supervisor. Oh no. Um, this lady who works for the, the Board of Education we, uh, by we I mean my other buddy of mine who also does freelance work, uh, we're curious as to whether or not we could continue doing freelance work occasionally when we had free time. Hmm? And a uh, guy working for the prefecture, basically the state I live in, uh, said, yeah, basically you can as long as you're not actually being employed by a country, uh, company in Japan. Right. And then the lady who is above my supervisor, said, well, no. Um, but I checked my contract, and the contract specifically says that as long as I'm not using my work visa that Jet is providing me with to work for another country in, or another company in Japan, then all's good. Uh, that's relevant because one of my clients that I hadn't contacted and said I can't work for you anymore because I'm working with Jet contacted me and said, hey, we're going to have this big job with, like, 200 episodes of anime. You Whoa. want in? <laughs> and it's not just anime, it's Bleach and Gintama. Oh. <laughs> so I was like, um, yeah, sure, let's do this. I can do, like, an episode a day after I get home from work. Because uh, that'll look fucking amazing on my resume. Yep. I'm obviously not going to be doing all of them. Uh, no, 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 that'd be insane. Because that would, yeah, I wouldn't be able to do that in the time limit. I have like seven weeks to work on it. Uh, but they're like contract, or contacting all of their uh, their employees and being like, hey, you want some of this? And I'm like, haha, yes. I think I only get paid like 40 bucks an episode or something. But times that by, like, the 40 episodes that I'll translate in seven weeks? Yeah. Make that money. I'll do it. Well, that was bad. But I still fixed it. I'm not even really worried about the money, because I get paid well enough to not care, um, but putting that on my resume, that I care about. That, yeah. No, sounds like it'd be pretty solid there. Yeah, what's that? I, I provided subtitles for DVD releases of Bleach, huh? Yeah. <laughs> that is, uh, that's a good one. Yeah. I I'm hoping I'll get Bleach, because I told him, like, I at least know Bleach a little bit. Like, I know a little bit about the plot and all the terminology yeah. and stuff. Gintama I've never watched once. 
Oh, that's right. Shield dashing is a thing in this game. Yep. That's basically all that. I do for the first half. Then it's bat shit. Yep. Literally bat shit crazy. Ah, fuck off, flea men. Flea men. No. no. Stupid fucking flea men. No, you machi nasai. Not in the mood. Also, it's interesting to find out that they translated that in the, the way that they did. In Japanese, it's more like, Hold your fucking horses! And in English, she goes, Wait a moment! Did you skip another... That thing with Maria in there? Yeah, cutscene. Cutscene skips. Well, yeah, um, the way it works is actually pretty simple. Uh, if you play in a clear file, you can skip the cutscenes. Oh, wow. So, when you speedrun this, you always play in a clear file. That makes sense, then. That's also why you can buy the duplicator. Got it. I always forget that this is a new game. Ah, uh, clear file. Yeah. You also, I... Well, no, you can. I, it's... I think it's more difficult to do the direct or the uh, the death skip in a new game, but I've done it a couple times. Feel good to be streaming again. Yeah, no, it's really nice, especially considering I'm doing it from uh, console now. Yeah, buddy. Like, I didn't really believe it before, but it does make a huge difference. Those inputs and shit. Yeah, like all the inputs that I'm not losing anymore. Everything running twice, well, not twice as fast, but it feels twice as fast. Like, I've well, gone back to, to play um, Mega Man X on an emulator since then, just because I didn't have a capture device for it, a Super Nintendo at the time. And I put up X2, started trying to do stuff to, to, to practice, and I was like, nope, this is a fucking slideshow now. I am, I refuse. That's right, I can hook up my, since I got a, finally got a spare TV, I can hook up my PS and play this game too. Yeah. I'm eventually gonna get a 360 here. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get a, like a Japanese 360. Wow, I went really slow if it's foggy outside. Um, either gonna get a Japanese 360 or I might just wait until whenever my dad comes to visit me pretty soon and be like, hey dad, can you uh, bring me wait. my Xbox 360? <laughs> Did you just clip through those stones before they lifted? I have no idea what you're talking about. After the doppelganger fight, like... Oh, that no, you you kind of clipped through the beginning, but uh, you can't move through it until the stones are completely out of the way. Oh, it just looked like the stones were still there when you... Yeah, they were still there the when I was, like, moving into it, but you can't pass through the wall or anything. You have to wait for the stones to completely go away. Alright, gotcha. I started learning Mario 3 for this 12-hour speedrun challenge. Nice. Oh, like, oh, you can have to go. Cause like the whole thing, Lasso or just uh, warpless? Warpless. Okay. I let Lasso talk me into it. Yeah, I kind of want to do that eventually, since I know how to do uh, no wrong warps, which is pretty fun. Yeah, um, so I, in addition to learning it for that, it was also for the SMB3 race, like the uh, tournament that the, they were holding. Get yourself speeding, speed running? No, thing? no, no, this was an SMB3 round robin. Oh, yeah, 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 the thing that I watched Lasso do a little bit of. Yeah. Oh god damn it. I've done that jump once where you get that uh gem with the wolf jump. Yeah, that's not just bad. from watching you and <laughs> Marsh do it. Yeah, it's pretty easy. That's one of the easiest tricks in this run. For some reason, uh -huh. something about running upstairs with the wolf lets it jump really, really high. Hooray, broken geometry. Yep. Or momentum. Broken physics. But what's weird is um like, I had my first race in the tournament last week, and it did not go as well as I would have hoped, but, uh, even worse, they put it on fucking SRL. <laughs> yeah, that tends to happen. What's this? I'm doing a terrible race? Oh, you're showcasing me now. Yay! Yeah, because they had planned it on, like, please, please let there be that Mega Man 2 tournament at the same time, so... Glib has to host it on his channel instead of SRL. Nope. 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 No such luck. Finish with a 218. Which, surprisingly, isn't the worst on the leaderboard, so... Yeah, it doesn't sound like it would be that bad for... Because you're, you're not doing Hundo, but you're doing pretty close. 
Yeah, war yeah, warpless. I die I game over like three times. Yeah. Let me look at my splits for that. I think World 3 was my worst with the water. Tick, oh, you have to wait tick, for the tick, tick come on. Yeah, uh, the game has an internal clock, and that left side of the clock only opens on even numbered minutes. Lovely. Uh, which is why the goal for a really good Soten Runner is to get to the clock room before eight minutes, so you have a little bit of time to get a couple hearts, and then the clock opens. Uh, I got there at like 9.30, which means I have to sit there for 30 seconds. Like, even if I got like a 9.15, it wouldn't matter, because I'd have to sit there the whole time. Let's see... Open splits. Like, that's one of the reasons why I really want to switch to uh, 360. Like, I know that my movement is definitely part of it, and I'm working on improving that by watching a bunch of better Soten runners and adapting some of their techniques. Right on. But uh, playing on uh, PS2 puts you at a severe disadvantage of like 30 seconds throughout the whole run. Really? Yeah. PS2 load time's issue? Yep, load time is terrible. Uh, the 360 version is basically an emulator. Oh, uh, right. But a much better emulator. So it, it uh, goes through all of the, like, every time a life up spawns, every time there's a loading screen between worlds. Uh, it's so considered the faster. Anytime there's like a little barrier like this uh, in the boss fight that I'm doing, right. uh, where it goes down, there's usually a considerable amount of lag. Is that on the PS2 or on the 360 version? You're PS2. Saying? There's like no lag in the 360 version at all. Is the PS1 version still like on the actual PS1 the best way to go? No. No, 360 is really? the best way. Really? Because it, the... it eliminates all of the uh, loading and lag right. problems. Like, even just doing, like, the teleport that I just did to the, uh, the Magical Library, uh, that takes considerably longer on the PS2 than it does on the 360. Yeah. Alright, let's see if I can get this fucking glitch first try this time. I think I can. Feels like it. Yeah. And how does that yeah, work? Yeah, come that on. Compared to the, uh, uh, PS3 yeah, got version? it. Do you know? Huh? Do you know how that compares to the PS3 version? Um, no, I don't know a lot of details about it. I would assume that it's probably faster than the console that it was on. Probably faster than PS1, PS2. Um, but I was told, because I asked about it, uh, I was told that the 360 is still faster for some reason. Okay. But it's better than the PS2. But I assume yeah. that it's probably better than playing it on console. Gotcha. Right on. <laughs> Gem selling, equip the gem. Duplicate that Sell shit. Sell the gem, go back in. Yay, duplication! <laughs> you're watching on your phone? Yeah, I do that occasionally. Uh, if you're watching on the phone, I, I recommend not using the official Twitch app, because it's garbage. Is there a better um, one? Yeah, there's a better one called Locky2. Three and World Eight were my worst ones. Hmm. I got that backwards. On a prism, sure I should probably practice more. I'm gonna throw your stream over on my over here. I'm gonna no, start practicing no. Mario. Oh, what happened? <laughs> Nothing major. I just fucked up something minor. It's still not good. Still not good, but it is considerably better than my last run, where it took me, like, uh, I think three or four tries to get to the fairy card. So I've got, like, a minute I can save on this split coming up here. Oh, right, those healing effects give you temporary invulnerability. Yeah! It's really good. But, like, here, in the, uh, the lesser demon room, for example, like, the books... Uh, like the explosion where the books let me out is laggy to a certain extent because of the uh, the life up popping up. It's pretty shitty. Uh, magical ticket. And now it's shurikens. All shurikens all the time. No, now it's all bats all the time. 
the Sonic that with the wing attack thing yeah. or whatever. Miss could pass. So I love that. Oops, that was my bad. Oh wow, I suck at uh, infinite ring smash today. Well, that was dumb. <laughs> Let's try the infinite ring smash. Oh, I'll just fly forward, it's okay. Yeah, I forget that to tell uh, Phil that me and Lost have to adjust our race for retro racers. Oh yeah, when is that happening? No one's told me any uh, information about that. April, like I sent you an invite to the Discord, but you probably didn't see it before it expired. Ah, uh -huh. EFT yeah. made one, gotcha. and that's where the planning's been going. Um, it looks like it's April eighth through tenth. Okay. I don't know if I can do anything for that. I don't know what days it are, uh, they are for me, because it's a different date, obviously. Right. Uh, but it sounds like it's probably a weekend here you guys. Uh, so yeah. I'll be able to do stuff for the second and third day. Or the first and second day, but not right. the third, because it would be Monday for me. Right. Yeah. Uh, we were supposed to do a Pokemon Red race to Surge um, using the Squirtle versus Nidoran route to show the different routes. Oh, nice. But cool. Lasso is finding that he hates the, the Squirtle route a lot. <laughs> I'll just find somebody who doesn't. So we he wanted to turn into a Bingo, but I'm like, I'm, I'm just thinking like that's such a variable time length thing. Yeah. Ow! Fuck off. Ah. Also, stuff like what I'm doing now with uh, mist batting and using potions and stuff. Way is a lot easier. Here. No, way laggier on the PS2. Oh, gotcha. Like, uh, if there are too many effects on the screen, it automatically lags, which is why, like, leveling up and getting the life ups, or just them spawning, uh, using potions, stuff like that, all causes a bunch of lag on the PS2. Just existing. Basically. Let's hope I can get the Richter skip first try, that'd be nice. Yeah, I got it. Still lost eight seconds. I don't know how I did that. Well, I did kind of fuck up the clock tower portion a little bit. Still 43 seconds ahead, so I'm totally cool with that. Because you're filling your bat stuff, too. Yeah, I was fucking up my uh, wing smashes. Ooh, missed jump input game. On to the inverted castle. Come on. Come on, controller. Thank you. Oh, that was a waste. Oops. The inverted castle is such a neat little... Like, I don't want to call it an easter egg because I don't know... But I don't know how much it's pointed to in the main game. Uh... It's pointed to a little bit. Um, like, Maria, when you talk to her, she gives you little hints as to where the gold and silver ring are. Um, and then you get other little, uh, I don't want to call them hints, but like little uh, tidbits as to where uh, she will be and stuff like that. Not necessarily that she'll be there, but that, oh, there's this place where if you go there at this specific time, Oh wow, I've never gotten petrified by Medusa. Wow. Rip burn. No, it's still going pretty good, because my, my batting has been pretty good so far. Ooh, I hear, um, Lost Painting. Yeah. One of the better songs in this game. This and the one that plays in the Coliseum are probably my favorites. Yeah. But, um... Like, just the criteria to be Richter with the certain equipment or whatever to get to the upside-down castle. 
seems really obscure. It's kind of obscure, but at the same time, uh, like you need the um, the gold and the silver goggles. the gold and silver ring in order to get uh, get to where Maria is, where she gives you the goggles. Yeah. Um, and there's little hints in the game to tell you how to get those. And um, and like I said, there's also little things about oh. Here's this area that only opens when you have these certain things. So they're, they're not, it's not like completely obscure, but it is more like a uh, like a little treat for people who actually track down everything in the game. back there, that's my fault. Right. Actually doing pretty well, I feel. As long as I don't fuck anything up too majorly, I should be able to get like a minute off my PB. Well, I've been oh. crashing my bat into a lot of things. I should learn this piece before the first fort. Dude, Jorge, stick around. I'm literally about to finish the run in like a minute. <laughs> hey, don't go to bed on me now, man. How many attempts did it take you to learn um when you were that little bit of time you were practicing Mario 3, that first fort like P speed uh leap grab? Uh that came actually pretty naturally to me. Hmm. Um it's still kind of hard, like I'll only get it like half the time. But it wasn't like this ball busting thing that people make it out to be. Let me quickly make sure I, I actually keep... have the heart <laughs> refresh equipped. Looks like you just oh, that one room you you did a back dash and then turned into a bat to turn around using that momentum. Yes, sir. Or something. Fancy. It's not just for style points, it's actually the quickest way to get out of a uh, loading screen. BAM! Oh wow, I somehow lost a ton of time on the Richter skip? Or the Relic skip? Like 20 seconds? Oh damn. Oh, Relic skip is the one you just did with the heart refresh? Yeah. Like, I would have felt like I got a lot faster time on that, but I guess not. Dracula. Doesn't matter. Still gonna get a sub 24 if I don't fuck this up. Oh man, I remember that race you did with Marsh and you dot like when <laughs> you died on the bike because you got careless. Yeah, it happens. I think that was you. Yeah. Okay, you're dead. Fuck out of here, Shaft. Nobody you did me. indeed just make it in time for a, a PB, most likely. As long as, like, as long as I don't fuck up the Dracula fight, this should be a relatively decent PB. It's a freebie. Kind of. Because I, I basically got the, the fairy card first try, so that yes. basically means free time. That jump. Uh oh. Your stream might have. Oh, there. It just. I forgot how it went to black during that uh, opening of the Dracula fight. Come on! Die, motherfucker! Yeah! 2343! Cut the 24 by 15 seconds. Over 15. Nice. That's a good start.